Asia champions. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Raw, for getting me over the line. And just a nice day for both John Rahm and Ryan Palmer. And they played awfully well. We talked about that word chemistry, and they very different personalities. But they had a lot of it. And let's go down to Peter Costas. Peter? Thank you, Bill. I'm here with the winners. Uh, boys, I tell you what. Uh, that's some spectacular alternate shot play this week, 65-69. What was the key from your perspective, John? <laughs> it's been two very different rounds. Uh, uh, first day, we both played amazing, uh, made putts. That's why their score was so low today. Uh, I felt a little carried, because I was carried, for for a better part of the first few holes. And then, you know, on the back nine, I decided I needed, I needed to do a couple things on my own. And the birdie on the birdie on 10, the shot on 13, and, and that shot on 14, and the putt on 15, or, you know, I'm gonna take some pride on that because I needed to do something to feel good about today, at least. Well, you know, the key to team play, in my opinion, is you're gonna have bad holes, you can hit bad shots, but not two of you at the same time. And I, I thought you did a great job of combining when one of you's in trouble, the other one picked it up. Yeah, uh, after yesterday afternoon, uh, my putting was, was there today. I had, these greens got a little baked out and crusty, but I had some fabulous putts within, you know, four to eight feet and they were crucial um but man what a what a day you know it's so fun when you're playing with a guy that can hit as good as he does and then when i'm hitting my hit as well as i can you know it makes it for a lot of fun golf and uh nine years since the last one so uh we put up a, we, we put up a graphic and i gotta ask you it was over three thousand some odd days since your last win we all know, those of us in the golf world, what you've been through, you and your wife, off the golf course, struggles with your golf game. I know how hard you've worked. Just what does it mean to get back in the winner's circle now? Yeah, and they're here. <laughs> she and Mason, my son. So, uh, uh, pretty special. Well, i tell you what, we're all so happy for you. And you, you're heading off to Napa for a little de-stressing oh, you know I, I, I do my homework you know it, uh, <laughs> and you should be doing it with a little bit of fun uh, wins in each one of your years on tour um, how does this set you up for the rest of the year well th this is a very special one uh, obviously it's, it's very special for Ryan and, and I'm really really excited to be able to share with that with him because you know he definitely earned it today I mean all those putts he made and uh, you know I've been coming with a lot of top tens this year and that shows everything. I mean, no, nothing I can say right now is going to be better than that. It, it, it's been a great week with him. He's a great guy. And I couldn't be prouder. He, he, he played a lot of good golf today. Well, you both deserve it. Go sign your card and make it official. And there's the emotion of winning on the PGA Tour. Up to you, Billy. Thank you, Peter. You like that? Ryan's wife, Jennifer, his son, Mason. He said they flew in for the final round. And, you know, we, we get out here. And some of, we get a little jaded to this experience yeah. of being out here. But these victories um, can be so meaningful in, in so many different ways for these players. And we're seeing that from Ryan Palmer and his family. There's uh, Kelly Cahill, who's John's fiance. She's been here all week. And people don't appreciate when you grind, 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 and you have to throw determination and you get...